Hello mga kasimpol! Kumusta kayo dyan? Medyo kinakabahan ako ngayon kasi may challenge daw sila para sa akin today. Isang cooking challenge na may time limit! Oh my God! Kakayanin ko ba? Ang challenge ngayon ay very challenging nga because we are using special ingredients which are diabetic friendly kasi alam mo na we have to be very conscious of our health kasi diabetes triggers a lot of sicknesses pero yan kasama kayon si Miss Layden an educator and diabetes nurse who will virtually assist me and guide me through my cooking na hindi lang dapat masarap yung kinakain natin but dapat healthy din because heart disease is also affected by diabetes. I didn't know that. You're going to help me cook, Miss Layden? <laughs> magluluto din ako dito. Sana pala nasa kitchen ako. Magluluto din ako. <laughs> Actually, I didn't know na ang diabetes and heart disease pala is connected. Kasi yun yung sinasabi lagi. It's really connected pala with the way we eat. So, can you tell me more about oh, that? Oh, ganyan yung uh, chef Tato nga, no? Diabetes kasi akala natin may namamatay sa diabetes. No, actually, it's the complications of diabetes. Isa sa mga komplikasyon ng diabetes actually is heart disease. Kasi pag nangyayari yan, pag uh, tumaas parati ang ating blood sugar, naa-apektuhan yung mga daluyan ng dugo. And alam na alam natin na ang sentro ng pagdadaloy ng dugo is galing sa ating puso, di ba? At ang nangyayari niyan, ang blood sugar natin is tumataas dahil din sa ating mga kinakain. Not, not about sugar, but the entire food na kinakain natin. And you are the best person who can teach us how to cook. Okay, Chef Tatong, I'm so excited talaga. And to learn our mechanics today, kasi may mechanics daw tayo, kasi pag hindi ko daw magawa, may consequence. Oh my God, so ano mo yung mechanics natin? Yan. So, bubunot na ako and saan ba ako magsa-start? Anywhere? Shrimp! Yan. Ay, ang sarap. Broccoli. Spinach! Parang buong grocery nandito yata nakalista. No? Potato. Ang hirap umiwas sa carbohydrates. That's my challenge. Kangkong. Carrot. And to recap, ang aking nabunot, di ba? Shrimp. Broccoli, spinach, kangkong, carrot, and potato. So I have to make two dishes based on these ingredients. Wala bang coaching? Pwede, pwede ba call a friend? Wala! <laughs> Magluluto na ako. Ano kayang lulutuin ko? Bahala na si Batman! And nandito na ako sa aking kitchen and ready for the challenge. Miss Layden, anong masasabi mo sa aking mga nabunot na ingredients? Swinerte ba ako or minalas today? Swerte ka yan, swerte. Balance ito. Yung gagawin ko lang, preamble lang sa lulutuin ko. This is how I would prepare a meal for myself. So thank you very much, Miss Layden. And I'm waiting for my countdown. Starts now. Now, sige. So, um, boil muna ako ng water. And I'm going to peel my potatoes and my carrots. Hala, one minute na. Hindi pa ako nakapagbalat ng aking patatas. Yan. Pero mabilis lang to Because naswerte ako yung protein ko. Cooks very quickly, which is shrimp. So, in two minutes, meron akong main course. Ang matagal kong lutuin is the potato and the carrot. water ko. Hindi pa kumukulo. But I will just add salt. Ayan. A carrot. Ito. I'll just boil it para mabilis lang ako later mag-cook. So ito, I'm used to just preparing some ginger. Saan man timer ko? Parang lugi naman ako dito. Hindi ko nakikita yung oras. Surprise! Pati time ko surprise. I'll just, I'll just let this boil my potatoes. Aha, uh -huh, and carrots. Yan. Dito ko na sa malaking apoy para mabilis siya. 
Yan, and I'll prepare my aromatics. Yan. May pangalan na yung recipe mo na ginuluto? Hindi ko pa alam. Pa? <laughs> Pag-isipan natin pag nabuo na siya. Yan. So, I have my onions and garlic. I have garlic here. Yan. Kasi meron naman tayo lagi nito sa bahay. Eh. Yung bawang, luya, sibuyas. Ito naman yung point mo. As long as you have the basics at home, kaya mo na magluto. Ano yung alternative natin na pwedeng kainin in place of rice? One cup of rice is equivalent to three slices of your bread, yung tasty, or six small pieces of your pandesal. Eto, Juan, ha? No judgment, ha? Nagmamadali ko time limit. So, hindi neat yung pagkuan ko ng aking mga dahon-dahon. I'll just rinse it. Chef, tatong ko na dyan ako. Natulungan na kita. Oo nga, eh. Yan. Eh, entertain me muna lang. Diba? Just entertain me while I'm cooking. So, halos actually, I'm, I'm practically done for my prep. Clumsy? Naging clumsy na ba ako? Careful with the Di knife. Naman. Yan. It's, it's natural. Natural lang yung pagluluto mo. Chef Tato, may request lang ako kasi mukhang isik-isik ang ginagawa mo. Siyempre, mga Pilipino tayo hindi nawawala ang panghimagas. Meron ka sweet potato. I love sweet potato. In fact, I like sweet potato better than potatoes. And wow, oh. Uy, time time ko na na stress ako sa time ko ah. Yan, gagawin ko ihabol ko na dito yung aking kamote. Dito na ako ha mag-peel ha. So, yung gagawin ko dito sa aking broccoli, bring out the color, pero do I have time to blanch? Sige, subukan ko kung kaya ko pang mag-blanch ng broccoli. May time pa ba? May time pa ako. Pag hindi ko ito nabuo, magtitiktok tayong dalawa. <laughs> yung bang challenge nating dalawa? Wait. Mm, wait, nalilito na ako. Sige, my broccoli is here. Pag nagluluto ka, medyo zen lang, di ba? Kaya pag sinasabing, anong sekreto mo? Ang sarap-sarap ng niluto mo. Pagmamahal sa pagluluto. A, a lot of people say that na yung pagmamahal daw yung sekreto sa masarap na pagluluto. And ano ba yung pagmamahal? I think yung pagmamahal kasi is really manifested in the care you do when you're cooking. You're conscious na healthy ba yung pinapakain mo? Yun ang love sa pagluluto. Yan. Dahil yung caring na yan is extended to the person napakakainin mo. Correct. Yan. And I will just, again, pinch of salt into my blanching liquid. Ito siya. What we're doing, I want to blanch it para lumabas yung kulay ng aking broccoli. And ako, I become very conscious with with the food I eat because, yun nga, last year, nagka-scare ako sa aking sugar. Kakachop ko lang ng sibuyas, sinihingal ako. Yun pala. Mataas sa pala yung aking sugar. And actually, ang kagandahan niyan, Chef Tatong, ano, if you are aware na tumataas ang sugar mo, you can control it. Eh. Kasi ano yan, eh, a combination of your food that you take and your physical activity. Plus, of course, kung talagang kailangan mo na maggamot, uminom ng gamot, go ahead. Pero ang kagandahan nga, you are in control of that. Hindi yung diabetes sa magkocontrol sa'yo. I'll just show you. I like my broccoli na malalaki, ha? I don't like it cut into small pieces. I like it really chunky. Yan. Sige. And this is what I will do. So, I think I changed my mind sa lulutuin ko. I, ideally, yung una kung saan ang gagawin is parang gigisa ko yung shrimp. Pero one thing that I'm known also dito sa, dito sa office or even at home is that lagi ako naghahanap ng sabaw. So, instead of making a stir-fried shrimp na may ginger and all that, Gagawin ko na lang siyang sabaw, na parang siyang 
pesa of sorts, di ba? So, what I will do, very simply, I will just add my ginger here, part of my ginger, and my onions. So, ito na yung magiging sabaw ko. And all the nutrition, nandiyan na siya, and even the kamote, partly I cooked the kamote there. Just add a tomato. Yan yung pang-asim ko. And I sliced my siling pang sigang. I changed my mind because I don't want my soup to be too spicy. I will add that there. Ay, eto, gagawin ko niya kong vegetable. I'm going to make like an oyster, parang Chinese-Chinese yung peg ko. Have that there, ready. Dissolve, dissolve. Very quick. Oil, I will use olive oil. I will saute my garlic. And I will just put my garlic here. Tingnan mo ha. Hindi pa siya fully cooked. Hindi siya, para hindi siya mapahit. I will remove my garlic. There's still a little bit of oil there. I will add a little bit of ginger. I want it spicy. The way to add uh, flavor is to add spices, no? aromatics, without adding cal calories, di ba? Don't worry. Yan. Oh. And you know that the vegetables are cooked already, so what, are your, what you're doing is just, you're just coating it in your sauce. Look at that. Okay, and... First dish done. Oh, di ba? Ito yung aking side vegetable. Yan, aking broccoli. Very easy to do, di ba? And yung aking garlic. Yan. Ah, alam ko na. I have an idea. So, ito, this is my soup base. And I will season it with patis. I think I'll just add muna two tablespoons. Yan. Mm. Perfect! Uy! So, I think yung kakainin ko na shrimp ay 5 pieces lang. O, oh, ba? Ang sarap nito. Uh, just a reminder for people with diabetes and we want to prevent uh, any further damage to our body. Kung halimbawa, naglagay na tayo ng seasoning sa ating food when we are cooking, dapat avoid damang yung one thing that we have to teach people, especially in cooking, sobra nating bumabanat ng alat, no? But one way to bring out the flavor of food is to add an acid, no? So you use calamansi, you use lemon, all sorts of natural vinegars is good for you. I'm going to prepare my plate now. So, yan pag-usapan din natin after, after this is um, ano yung mga myths when it comes to diabetes or diabetes control? And my soup is done. I just need a soup bowl. So, ito siya. And by separating all the elements, it feels sa marami yung ula mo. ba? Oh, look at that. Oh. And you have a complete meal na. Kompleto yan. Pero may dessert pa ako, sorry. Oh, I'm so messed up. Boil mo na rin yung iyong kamote kanina, di ba? May time pa ko, I'll just rinse this. And ito siya. And I'm going to use gata because I have gata. And ito sa malaki para mabilis tayo. I still have time. How much time do I have? Still have 7 minutes. Oh, I still have 7 minutes. I have more than enough time. So, ito siya. Kasi hindi naman bawal mag-sugar, no? You just watch your sugar intake. Um, this is coco sugar. Yeah, just a little for a nice color. One way of um, giving that impression of sweetness is to add sweet spices. So I'm going to add. Meron akong cinnamon kasi dito. Hmm, bango. Diba? Mix that. Then I will just add my kamote. Yan. So I will just let that simmer, no? Para ikaw, natatakam ka ba sa aking preparation? Kanina pa ako natatakam, kaya lang, paano kaya kakainin siya tatong? Eh, virtual tayo ngayon. If, uh, papadala namin, virtual. <laughs> <laughs> still have one minute, chef. Oh, one minute, ha? Huh? One minute. Plating oh. ka na. And it 
next time. Ay, lating. Five, four, three, two, woo! And we're done. Woo! Challenge achieved and actually nagugutom na ako. Um, I'm going to move to another table. Taste the entire, you know, meal I have in front of me while you watch, unfortunately for you. Pero pag-usapan natin yung connection ng diabetes and heart disease and all the other complications of having a not so healthy lifestyle. So, guys, join me as I taste and savor food for thought with our conversation with Miss Layden. And we're back and I'm ready and I'm hungry and I have my dishes. So here it is, our uh, boiled shrimp. It's simply boiled shrimp and vegetables. We can call it tesa. We can lagyan natin ng pangpasip, tawagin natin sinigang. But a very simple way of preparing a dish and we have our greens here. We have our potatoes or whatever you have. And I have my broccoli which I sauteed simply in a little bit of garlic and ginger. I put a little bit of chilies para may, you know, something that pops, no, in your palate. And of course, my dessert is my kamote with gata. And para hindi masyado maraming sugar na nilagay ko, I added a bit of cinnamon to give it that sweet aroma. Kahit na hindi ka diabetic, it's it's good for you, di ba? Yung kinakain mo ngayon is for all. Not only for people person with diabetes. Pag sinabi may diabetes, you have a particular meal for you. No, it's not true. Ang pagkain natin para sa lahat. Yung mga kasambahin natin, pag ikay may diabetes, sasabihin, o ito lang kakainin mo. Ito amin lahat. It's not. It's not that. So, simply put, ang sagot sa diabetes ay, huwag matakaw. <laughs> Di ba? Ganun lang kasimple, ba? You just portion your food properly and you eat what is meant for that meal. You don't eat what is for tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> Balikan natin yung niluto ni Chef Tapo. Kung mapapansin niyo po, ang dami niyang gulay. May portion yan eh. And we recommend or we, mga isang isagtihiyan yan is yung portioning sizes. Ang pag-portion natin sa ating pinggang, pinggang Pinoy natin, dapat kalahati agad yan is gulay. And we encourage green leafy vegetable. O tingnan ninyo po yung, yung kay Chef Tapo na pagkain ngayon. It's gulay, spinach and kangkong. Ano po yung source ng kanyang rice? Wala siyang rice kung titignan ninyo. Pero nandun yung kanyang carrots at saka nandun yung kanyang uh, patatas. Tama po ba? And may maroon pa siyang isang side dish which is the broccoli. At nandun yung kanyang proteina, yung gal, ang pro sources ng proteina niya for the grow niya ay yung kanyang hipon. So, kompleto yung meal niya. Meron siyang carbohydrates, meron siyang portion ng maraming gulay galing sa spinach and and your kangkong at saka yung kanyang broccoli. Pero may impact ba sa diet pag maliit yung plato mo? Uh, we encourage na 9 <laughs> inches plate. Chef Tato, hindi naman platito lang. 9 inches. Okay, yung malaki yung regular size ng ating ano, regular siya ng plato. Ako, very important sa akin kasi yung dessert. Eh. Parang gratification ko na yan. Basta hindi ako mag-carbs, hindi ako magkain ng extra sweet na food. Magdi-dessert ako and I'm going to enjoy it without without any guilt. Pero my question is, does, does the salt have an impact to diabetes as well? Di ba? Usually sugar talaga siya. Pero sa akin, for me, iniisip ko, hindi na ako magmatamis, gusto ko malasa yung food ko. So pati salt pala, medyo... Yes. Mm. Yun yung kaya, di ba? For your sweet heart, sweet diabetes, heart is yung puso. Ang karaniwan, iyan ay yung mga, kaya ayaw natin dinadagdagan pa ng kung ano-ano mga masyadong salty. Because remember, salt is not so good to our body. We are only allowed to have one teaspoon of salt per day. So yun kasi ang isang magiging source ng 
katumas ang blood pressure mo, pag tumas ang blood pressure mo, affected ang kidney mo, pag affected ang kidney mo, your heart will be affected also. Yun din yun, even in cooking, some, ang, ang, ang kadalasa kasi nagluluto, dagdag ng dagdag ng asin para magkalasa, pero to be able to achieve a balanced flavor in your food, it's not just salt, you can add acid, you can add a little bit of fat, but also in terms of cooking, mas nagiging complex yung luto mo because of all this. Tama, and that is good for your heart. Ang sinabi natin cardiovascular, it is not only for the heart, mm. but the entire system of our body. Mm. Wow. Akala ko magkaka-love life ako dahil sa campaign na to. Hindi pala. Healthier <laughs> heart. To be able to love more, di ba? How can you manage diabetes? How can you control your diabetes? Yun ang aming ano dun. Control your diabetes and control the quality of life that you have. Paano yan? Through your healthy eating. Number two is your physical activity. Increase your physical activity. Burn the calories that you have taken. Naging sugar sa katawan natin. And of course, if the doctor says you have to take this medication, be compliant, adhere to the treatment. Do not let diabetes control you. Control your diabetes. So, eto, I have some frequently asked questions about diabetes and like for me coming from a family like my grandfather's had diabetes is it a disease that is hereditary or is it lifestyle based and what are the steps we can do to to prevent it is it hereditary yes it is is it a lifestyle yes can we prevent it yes yes Okay, hereditary na mamana plus na mamana na Asian pa tayo. Yun yung mga risk factors na tinatawag natin. Then lifestyle, of course, physical inactivity and healthy food that we are eating. So ano sabi natin how to prevent? Dapat healthy eating, increase physical activity. Please avoid smoking and then limit your alcohol intake. You can prevent it. There are a lot of... Uh myths about diabetes and I'm going to read some and I'd like to um, an answer yes or no. Um, ito, number one. Fast talk! Diba ito? Ang matataba lang ba ang nagkaka-diabetes? Mali! Oy, kayo din. Yan, di ba? Kayo din. Akala nyo, kami lang. Kayo din. <laughs> number two. Yan. Diabetes can't be cured. That sentence ba ang diabetes? Wala pang cure pa, but we can control. Ito, bawal ang carbs, lalo na ang rice, at lalo na ang only rice. <laughs> Yung only rice ang bawal. It really worries me kung talagang bawal. Bawal ba ang sugar at matatamis? Hindi. Ang kailangan mo lamang, moderation lang yan. So, thank you very much. Sobra akong natuwa dito sa ginagawa natin today. Akala ko, cooking challenge lang siya. Pero, I'm learning a lot and I'm very happy for your campaign. I'd love you to invite them to to visit your your page and to, you know, to be more concerned about your heart and your wellness. Yes. And of course, if you will be able to manage your diabetes, you manage also your heart. And that is our program. And you may, the information you can, can get it is from our site, which is www.foryoursweetheart.ph. And you may take the FAP Ramming Hand Assessment Test if you are at risk of having a cardiovascular disease. And learn more about diabetes and your heart. Thank you so much, Chef Tatong. Really, I enjoyed the cooking, the cooking lesson. So I hope um, all of you um, visit the site and Take the survey to determine if you need care for your diet, you need care for your heart, and you need care for your diabetes. And thank you very much. This has been Chef Tatong. Simple! <laughs> Delivery po donuts for Chef Tatong. Ay! Ibalik mo na lang yan sa nagpadala. 